Sorry, being opened last 4th of July. Oh, it was, Mama, all the evening. Mama, a man with a suitcase has been following me all over town. No, who? Well, I never saw him before. Oh, did he say anything? He tried. Well, did you say anything? Mama, of course not. No, don't. Total amaryllis. So don't me, me a little slower and please keep the fingers curved as nice okay, and high as you possibly can. Don't get faster, dear. Don't mind my saying so. It wouldn't hurt you to find out what the gentleman wanted. I know what the gentleman wanted. What? You'll find it in Balzac. Oh, well, excuse me for a living, but I never read it. Neither is anyone else in this town. There you go again with that same old subject about the low mentality of River City people and taking it all too much to heart. Now, Mama, as long as Madison Public Library was entrusted to me for the purpose of improving River City's cultural level, I can't help my concern that the ladies of River City keep ignoring all my counsel and advice. But darling, when a woman has a husband and you've got none, why should she take advice from you? Even if you can't quote Balzac and Shakespeare and all the other highfalutin dreams. Mommy, if you don't mind my saying so, you have a bad habit of changing every subject. No, I haven't changed the subject. I was speaking of the stranger. A stranger. With the suitcase who may be your very last chance. Mama, do you think I'd allow a common national? Now, really, Mama, I... I know all about your standards, and if you don't mind my saying so, there's not a man alive who could hope to measure up to that blend of Paul Bunyan, St. Pat, and Lower Webster you've concocted for yourself. Out of your Irish imagination, your Iowa stubbornness, and your library full of books. Well, if that isn't the best I ever heard. Thank you. Oh, 